Today we're going to show you how easy it is to use the tiny switchy switch modifier with a battery operated toy. Battery operated toys can be temporarily adapted using a battery interrupter. Or as we've done here, toys can be permanently adapted by wiring a connector into the toy. But this may still be a challenge for the user. They may have the ability to briefly activate the switch, but haven't yet developed the ability to keep the switch active. Or perhaps they would prefer to toggle the toy on and off, instead of holding the switch down as one might want with a radio, for example. The perfect solution is the tiny switchy switch modifier, which takes the simple switch and turns it into either a toggle on, toggle off switch, or with the press of a button, a time switch that holds the switch closed for fractions of a second to many minutes. There are only two buttons on the tiny switchy. The mode button sets the mode, either toggle or timed. Each time we press the mode button, it changes mode, indicated by the LED. If we want the toggle mode, we just press the mode button until the toggle LED is lit. Notice each time we press the switch, the toy is turned on or off. We'll press the mode button to get to the timed mode. For the timed mode, we can set duration by pressing and holding the time button. Let's do a count of three. One, two, three. Now, when the user activates the switch, the toy is on for about three seconds. Note that when we set the time, the mode is automatically changed to time mode as a convenience. But normally we'll want to use the mode button to change modes, unless we want to set a new duration time. The tiny switchy is small. The footprint is smaller than a business card and less than an inch thick. It's light too, barely over an ounce. It's small enough to always have with you as you move from room to room or building to building. The tiny switchy runs off a small coin cell battery, which lasts for years. Did you notice there's no power switch? It's always on, but uses virtually no power until the switch is hit or we press the buttons. Use the two screws to open up the case and replace the battery when needed. Inside the tiny switchy is entirely solid state. There are no mechanical relays to wear out. It is fast and easy to add toggle and time behavior to a simple switch using the tiny switchy. Thanks for watching.